So we drove down to Omaha. Right now the golf course and is threatened. And last week we took a road trip and drove all through that country. That that's the area we're pretty certain where the fire is. from the east
So uh, our rifle range, our bow and arrow range, and the archery that we've driven most of that area and seen beer, bear and deer. And there's a little lake, fishing lake, it's going to be affected. About 25. Probably 25 miles an hour. And uh, yeah, uh, so we're talking about uh, that golf course area and the north of that. Yeah, north of that. It's west of that. West, right now. yeah. Uh, but uh, depending on what the wind does, um, our, town, our town has got some problems. It's going to cross the highway. It's not going to cross Highway 3. Yeah, it'll cross Highway 3. Um, yeah, it's, it's major. Um, and partly what alerted us to it's time to stop watching baseball was that one or two of our fire trucks just went by on Kingfisher. And we can see them uh, up on the edge of the mountain. Is that on the Canadian side, Wally? Yeah, that's Canadian. You think that's Canadian side, too? Yeah. Okay, so our Oh, and there's house lights up there. Five miles. We're, four miles. Yeah. As the flies, that's four, four miles. Three, three um, to four miles. Well, it's going to depend highly on what happens with the wind, but there's a lot of territory yet between it and us. Um, okay, oh, you okay, you're seeing that at so much uh, acreages and so on up there. Yeah. Okay, well, it's fast. Raven Court, Bachrath, Cap Drive, Torrey Pipe Drive, Raven Drive, Red Plains, Oil Bridge, Okay, that's it. That's the golf course. That, that's all that, um, all those homes on the golf course. Uh, an alert or, an, or uh, I don't think it should be an evacuation. No. It's an evacuation alert. Oh, evacuation alert, yeah. What's your street address? 8305 66 We've got uh, a link between us. What are you talking about? The lake for, for us in the fire. But what about up yeah. there? Yeah. This is where the golf course is. Yeah. That wind is blowing from our back, so it's blowing it away. It's putting the fuel.